Now at six, he was just seven years old when he made aviation history, and it happened right in our backyard in Kill Devil Hills. So where is a record-breaking child pilot today? Philip Townsend tracked Daniel Shanklin down and has a look into the 13 News Now vault. It was 1991 and a history-making moment in Kill Devil Hills. It may not have been a picture-perfect landing, but what do you want from a seven-year-old who doesn't even have his driver's license yet? We were there as Daniel Shanklin became the youngest person to pilot a flight across the country. He was just seven years old. See that landing? Oh, he was trying to make it the best and it was a war. <laughs> Today, Daniel, 31 years later, is seeing the video for the first time. I've never seen this video before. Really? In my life. I've never seen this. I was not local. I'm sure there was kind of a little stories here and there that I missed. To this day, he's still the youngest pilot ever to do it, a hobby that was inspired by his grandparents. You know, it's an expensive hobby. <laughs> and that's why his jet-setting days are behind him. Daniel is now a software developer and a devoted husband and dad in Sugar Mountain, North Carolina. But he hasn't forgotten how important it is to set big goals. I tried to copy some part of this for my own kids. Uh, I took them on a 50-state journey back in 2018. They were five and seven. And like dad, they already have that need for speed. Now 11 and eight, Wyatt and Colleen ski race competitively. And yeah, they're well aware of dad's big accomplishment way back when. An accomplishment Daniel says does not define who he is. Still, there's one thing he wants to clear up. That landing. <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that how it always works? I mean, there was a big crosswind, so bounced a couple wheels, thankfully touched and down just, just fine, you know? So I'm still here today, not worried about it. <laughs> For 13 News Now, I'm Philip Townsend. All right, kids, even if you wanted to break Daniel's record, you can't. It is amazing, though. The Child Pilot Safety Act went into effect in 1996, which essentially prevents young kids from setting flight records.